am back today and the dumpster is completely full. The lid doesn't even close. That's wood flooring. There's some toys, some broken fishing poles. Found one croc shoe. I haven't found the other. Um, I am thinking that this is a job for my hubby to come back with. That's a little, that's the doll clothes. I haven't found the doll that goes there yet. And then what I've got so far is a little light. One doll, it's, it's uh, packaging is kind of squished. Looks like maybe it was even opened, but all of the clothes and everything are there. Here's a little toy. And then several clothing articles. Um, there's a shirt, just happens to be my size. Here's a back brace. Here is a scrub top. It's really, really big and it's stained. Looks like rust, maybe. Um, but you know what? If I cannot get that out, I can tie dye it and use that as a sleeping shirt because, you know, who doesn't want a great big sleeping shirt, right? Um, there's a little wallet. Like maybe a camera or something would go in it. Universal smartphone case. Well, there you go. It's a universal smartphone case. Um, here's a nice white shirt. I didn't see anything wrong with it other than it needs to be washed. A pair of men's chonies <laughs> underwear for those who don't know. Um, there's some slippers, lady slippers whole package of men's socks and I think hubby will be uh, glad of those this winter and um, like I said I, I don't know what else I can get out of there but I may bring hubby back tonight my goal was to go out early today because it is so dang hot and they've been putting so much meat in the dumpsters sandwich meats and stuff that I thought I want to get out earlier and catch that stuff when it's a little more colder. I've been getting it where it's barely cool to the touch, but um, yeah, I'd like to get it where it's colder and um, make me just feel a little better about it. Nobody's gotten sick and, and all the meat seems to be fine, but I just have that, you know, my spidey sense is tingling about something refrigerated. So I'm going to be checking on my spots today. Wish me luck. Quick trip to the pet store and we see lots and lots and lots of cut bags of food. But we also saw one big, let me see what size it is, 24 pound bag of dog food. Another one here, pet protective collar, pet protective collar, this is the calming thing supposedly, and then this, this thing right here um, for a fish tank, and hubby has a fish tank, a little bitty one that we found in here and put to use. So, um, you know, I haven't found anything here for a while. They have been cutting or, you know, having people watch it. And it just goes to show, just keep checking back. Okay, bye guys. Okay, Spidey Sense is rarely wrong. So far I have pulled out of there three packs of this oven roasted turkey. See the glistening? Still cold. And if I had waited till evening like I normally do, it wouldn't have been good anymore. So um, they're putting stuff out earlier in the day. So I got some garlic bread, a uh, cream cake, some donuts, some cheese danish, and um, some Swiss rolls. Right? 
raspberry. My hubby likes raspberry. So I'm gonna see what else I got. I saw a couple more packs of meat and I'm gonna go back for those. But um, you know, if you're getting that little tingling and you feel like you need to be there at a certain time, do it. Your instincts are rarely wrong. Okay, so I found another pack of donuts, two little mini cupcakes, an angel food cake, um, some powder donuts, some mac and cheese. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five of these French garlic bread. I guess it doesn't say French, but you know, it's like French bread. And um, two ham and cheddar Lunchables, still cold. And then the lunch meat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 packs of meat. There's one more Lunchable. Um, so yeah, I, I, I was absolutely right. I knew that they'd been throwing away sandwich meats lately and I just felt like in this heat, if I wait too long, um, yeah, that's some raw meat, gross for a vegan to touch. Um, hand sanitizer in the car and believe it or not, this hand, no glove. The one I'm holding the camera with, that's where my glove is. So <laughs> somehow I got turned around. I was holding the camera with my ungloved hand so I could turn it on and do the filming. And I, I got switched around and touched stuff without my glove, yuck. But anyway, san hand sanitizer, towels in the car, we'll be using that right away. And um, I still have one more stop to make actually guys. So um, fruitful day, um, when you know it's hot outside, a few people have asked, about taking meat when it's really hot, go early. Go early, touch it, make sure it's cold. Um, you know, go old school on it, sniff it, feel it. If it feels slimy, if it smells bad, it's not good. And um, regardless of what the date is, if it feels okay, it looks okay, it smells okay, it's okay. Have a good day, guys. Please do like and subscribe. Hi guys, it's Tina. Just wanted to give a quick message that what I'm doing isn't just for my family. It's for the other families that I assist and take food to. And it's for the food banks and the women's shelter that I also donate to. So if you believe in my cause and you want to help support me on my mission to save the environment one dumpster at a time, you can donate to the channel simply by buying me a coffee or two. You can find the link down in the description box. It's $3 US. So buy as many as you want or you can or just, you know, ignore the message if this isn't for you. But a lot of people have expressed interest in just how they can help and that's a quick way to do it. Have a good day, guys.